It's your favorite YouTube dealer, and I had absolutely no idea that this existed. So this is a has-been hotel song called Addict from, I think it says three years ago. I just assumed that this show just came out and that this was like the first of it. But obviously it takes time to work on, so they must have had some stuff out in the past. If there's some other old ones as well, please fill me in and let me know. But let's just get into this one and let's see what this is all about. Till death do us part But we're already past that phase This is a brand new start And I think I deserve some praise For the way that I am Despite having overdose And ending up comatose I don't give a damn I've let my emotions go Fuck being a sober hoe this is the mantra. <laughs> this is my life. Yep. This said F being a sober hoe. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Playing with now till the end of the night. Surrounded by fire, the passion ignites. A hidden and heaven and hell out of the heart. I'm addicted to the madness. This hotel is my Atlantis. We're forever gone. You fell deeper in this pit While death rains from above So count your blessings cause this is it You're not letting it go So what if I misbehave? It's what everybody craves You already know So come if you're feeling brave And fancy yourself a mate You want it, I got it See what you like could have it all by the end of the night. Your money and power, my sinful delight. I hit it a heaven and hell a hell of a high. I'm addicted to the madness. This I feel that. Sometimes I feel I'm addicted to the madness, so I'm being completely honest with you. Life can be a little crazy sometimes. We're forever gonna have a fucking reason to sin. Let me leave my soul of fun and I'll be breathing it in. I'm addicted to the feeling, getting higher than the ceiling. Now, I've not watched the show yet. I'm going to be watching the show. I know I've said this in every single reaction, but I record a lot of these back to back to back. You know what I mean? When they're all out together. So a lot of times that's why I'm, I'm saying similar things, at least in that aspect. So I do apologize. But this character here with the X on the eye, I know when I watch the first episode, there's the girl with the X where it's like kind of like hovering over her hair over one eye. Is that meant to be the same character and they remade the character or is this a completely different character? Because I don't think I've seen this one before. <laughs> Sherry. <laughs> Let's go. I love this. I'm addicted to the feeling, getting higher than the ceiling. And we're never gonna want this fucking feeling to end. Just conceal and give into your 
I used to get higher than the ceiling. Oh, I miss those days. Oh, wait, hold on. There might be a little bit more. Yeah, okay, this was fun. I enjoyed this. I enjoyed this. Listen, I used to get higher than the ceiling on a regular basis. Just with weed, though. No, no, nothing else, but I used to smoke quite a bit of weed. If anybody else used to smoke weed, please comment down below and let me know. Because I've, I've quit. It's actually, I'm eight days away from one year. I had to look up at the date. It's the 12th of February. I quit on February 20th of 2023. And I used to smoke like four to five blunts in a row back to back. Like big blunts I would roll with Dutch masters and I would smoke one. And as soon, I, as soon as I lit it, it was not going out. I smoked that whole thing straight through. And as soon as I finished, I'd open up my little Mason jar, pull another one out, smoke it all the way through the third one, the fourth one. And then if I had a fifth one, if I had six, seven, it just, it never ended. D despite how many I had, I would smoke through all of them, all of them. Four was probably the average though. And it's like, it got to the point where I don't even feel like I did get higher than the ceiling anymore. I feel like I had such a tolerance to it that I didn't even really get that high anymore. It was just like once I got as high as the first one got me, I, I just it was kind of like that was the level. And then everything else was just a habit. I just kept smoking because out of habit, I just wanted to keep smoking and watch things and stuff like that. And it's crazy to me, like to, to think that I was smoking that much like by myself, just back to back to back to back and some really good weed as well like really good weed that I'd get my hands on. And now, I mean, it was legal up until, like, I probably smoked for like two years or a year while it was legal here in New York. So it's like, I did get to benefit from that a little bit. Like I can go for a walk if I wanted and smoke. I could, you know, just, I, I didn't have to worry about it like I used to when I was younger. So I did benefit from that a little bit, but it had just previously became legal within the last year or two. And now my friend opened up a dispensary, which I still need to go and record some video there and stuff like that and maybe upload it to my main channel and just kind of show it off a little because it looks amazing inside. Like he did an unbelievable job with how it looks but it's like he has that now where he gets samples he's willing to to let people that he's friends with like myself or the friends that, that that are working there with him get some of the stuff at like the price that he would buy it for for the store and then he'll just put the rest in the store but let you have a little bit or give you some samples and stuff for free like all these beautiful good things are starting to come about that would save me money and just and it's like and I quit I quit I mean, I'm happy that I quit. I'm not going to go back just because now I can get some samples and I can get some different things. But it's just like, man, my whole life I've been waiting for this moment for someone to have that kind of connection because he has his own store now and for it to be legal. And as soon as all of that comes around, it's like, ah, I think I'm done. It's almost like you drink a lot before you're 21. Then as soon as you're 21, you're just like, eh, I don't really care. I can go to the bar now. Been there so many times. I'm kind of on to the next stage. It's just one of those things. So. Very interesting, but anyways, I'm on a tangent. I apologize. Nobody probably made it this far, but if you did, I appreciate you, and let me know if there's more old songs like this from Has Been Hotel. Let me know my question about that character, if it was redesigned, if that was a character that still exists, and I'm just thinking of a different one with the X on her eye, but this was dope. I enjoyed this. Um, contemplating doing a reaction to the show itself. Uh, the last reaction that I just uploaded though, I did ask that. So I got to see what the comments say. If they've seen other people doing reactions and they seem like they're okay to be on YouTube, then I will probably check some out and put it on my, my anime reaction channel. So we'll see where it goes from here, but I appreciate you guys. Take it easy. Stay safe. I'll catch you in the next one, homie.